Steve is going to tell us about this freshwater tank now. Yeah, so uh, this tank, uh, all live plants, live plants and a good number of fish. Um, this tank is a good example if you were looking for something maybe a little bit lower maintenance. Some of these plants are more forgiving as far as the amount of light required, uh, the fish load, and the, uh, the, the bio load produced the by these fish. Honestly, keep the plants going pretty good and you get a pretty good balance. Um, and really that's the key with any plant tank or coral tank um, is getting a good balance so that things stay looking the way you want them to and you don't have algae galore. So um, that would be a good example of a lower maintenance uh, plant system. Then you can come over here and this one requires a little bit more baby and you've got some bright red plants, got a little bit lighter fish load as you can tell. Um, so not all of these are higher maintenance. This is kind of a mix on plants, but this tank definitely gets a lot more babying. We do the CO2 injection with this system. Um, we do a lot more as far as supplementation. The balance becomes that much more delicate between fighting off algae and keeping the plants looking happy. If it makes plants happy, it makes algae happy, and that's, you know, the unfortunate reality. So that's where things get a little bit more complicated. But that's a, that's a really fun system. It's a really pretty one. Thank you. Um, salt water over here, we've got this is a, uh, would be an example of a higher uh, maintenance salt water. You've got a lot of these corals along the top that you can hopefully tell from the video are pretty uh, rigid. Um, they're calcareous corals. Um, they use up a lot of calcium. So the dosing has to be a lot more consistent with these guys. They like higher flow, higher light. Um, so that's an example of some stuff that does require a little bit more maintenance, a little bit more involvement with your hobby. If you got a busy schedule, this might be a little bit more challenging system to maintain. On the same hand with salt water, over in this tank, this is a much lower maintenance system as a whole, primarily because of the coral choices. Most of these guys are not uh nearly need as needful of uh, calcium magnesium supplements like that uh, this is the kind of tank that if you were out of town for a week you could probably just have some of the stuff auto set as far as top offs and lightings and and probably not need to worry about it at all honestly while you were gone um, this one for the folks that travel a lot that have a lot more going on this would be a much better example of uh, low low tech easier to maintain. Very good. Thank you so much, Steve. That's very helpful. Yeah, you're very welcome.